Yo, what up everybody? Welcome back to another video and it's me. They call me Heat. If this is your first time watching, I'm a music producer of over 10 years. And on this channel here, I show producers how to make some of the best boom bap style beats. We back cooking up that boom bap again. I'm just searching for some samples, about to cook something up. I think I found something. So yeah, so let's dive in and, um, you know, check the sample out. I'll play the sample for y'all and then we can, I can start chopping things up and seeing where I want to go with the drums. I know I kind of want to go for a more bouncy uh, vibe, you know. Um, let's just dive in. Let's get into it. Let's go. <laughs> Now that's kind of dope right there. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put this in Serato sample and just see what, um, what I can do in there with this. Let's get to chopping this bad boy up. We don't get crazy with this right here. So got some good chops, I feel like. Okay, so I took a moment to go through and just see if there's any chops that maybe I'm missing. Maybe there's some stuff that I could, you know, other stuff that I can put in there too. I didn't really find anything else, which is fine. Maybe later on I will, but now I'm gonna uh, start messing with some drums and try to get a nice swing going. go back to the sample and kind of see what it sound like again so I built a very like simple drum pattern just to get things started because I don't really know how the sample will fit with the drums yet but I always like to build my drums first just so I can have that dope groove you know so I'm putting this like roll snare in there I'm gonna drop some of the lows out to make it stand out some more Okay, we about to make some heat with this right here. We gonna make some heat with this one right here. So I laid the sample down, of course I got my chops down, but now there are extra like pieces that I want to put in. So like other little chops that I added in, I want to kind of sprinkle those in there too. 
Let me get these pieces on point so everything sounds cohesive. Yep, all right, so I need a hi-hat in there. I need it fast. I found this one. And I also got this like crash sound that I'm gonna use as like an open hat. Cause it's got like a to it. And what I can do is set the crossfade loop to be sure that when I hit the pad, it doesn't play any further than you know what I'm saying, what I let the pad uh, play for. So I'm gonna use that as an open hat, but I'm gonna use this. Sounds good with that with that hi hat. I definitely want to put that crash in there, but I want to mess with the pitch. I think I want to mess with the pitch. All right, I'm back where I where I ended up anyway, so I'm just stay here. Now let's find a place for that that crash. Ah, it's not gonna fit like I thought. Oh well, happens. Might have something there. It just sounds like white noise. Simple, man, we got this. Now I'm gonna go back and add to the, the drums really quick, because I feel like I can make this just slightly longer. We need a funky bass line. Maybe I can get crazy on the bass line here. Let me see where we at. So one thing that I learned um, watching like just OG producers, right? Um, I watched Knotts, if you guys don't follow him on Instagram, at Knotts, uh, I think it's Knotts Raw. But anyway, like watching his posts and just seeing how he produces certain beats, I noticed that he, you know, sometimes won't play the full bass line out. Like he'll just play like one note, like just the first note, boom. And then that's it, you know what I'm saying? So he'll do things like that. So I'm gonna try that with this beat just to kind of incorporate that, well, this is how you incorporate, you know, the greats and their way of producing into your producing by just taking simple things that they may do, applying it to you, you know what I mean? So what they say is, um, good artists borrow, great artists steal. I've always heard that, if, I think that's the correct like pattern, but yeah, so like, you know, it's you, you still wanna be yourself, but you wanna take something from someone else and apply it to what you do 
and it could make your process either better or you just have a better understanding of the process as a whole. So that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to use his, you know, technique on this bass line in this beat because I think it sounds good. I think it sounds dope like that. So something for you guys to try out. So this is just something extra that I think I want to put in as far as like, like sounds or vocals or whatever. So y'all know I like arcade, so I pulled that out and I got some vocals. That's pretty much the only thing I want to add in. It's not like, I don't want to flip it into like an R&B track or nothing like that, but it just sounds good to go like at the beginning. Sounds like it may have been in the sample or the, you know, the record. Reminds me of like some early like maybe uh, Busta Rhymes and Missy or something like that. Kind of take me back to that time a little bit. You know, fast Busta Rhymes lyrics and stuff like that. Let me play back what I've added though. All right, everybody, that is the end of the video. You know, um, it came out kind of dope. I mean, I didn't have an idea for it at all. I just grabbed the sample up because I heard it on YouTube. <laughs> and I chopped that boy up and we made some dope, like I said, Busta Rhymes, like Missy Elliott kind of vibe. Of course, somebody knew would sound dope on it, but that's just what it, it gave me. That's what spoke to me when I was making it. It came out pretty dope. I like, you know, how I chopped the sample. I like the vocals that I put in. I did end up changing the vocal sound. To this <laughs> so that was dope i mean it just gave it a different vibe um so you know i'll definitely play the beat for you guys to check it all out so you can see like the outcome and how it sounds now but yeah i'm gonna get up out of here if you like the video make sure you subscribe i hope that you know i inspire somebody to go create that boom bath make sure you cook that boom bath every day of your life all right Peace.